the basic thing that in all painting is the area, uh, uh, line, uh, space, and color. That's all it is. When you put a color next to each other, it creates a sensation. And you put another and another and another, and it creates a total different personality of that painting. And each one has a different personality there. So that's kind of, you know, excite me to create. And when I was about eight years old, I started to trace comics. And then I started to do my classmates, you know, and movie stars and baseball players and boxers. I was not a healthy child. You know, I had asthma, so my father was happy if I sit in the corner and just do the tracing. And I remember doing a tree. The tree is still there. It's a monkey pot tree. And I did it in blue and red. And the, the teacher said, her name was Mrs. Wong. And she said, that's not a tree. I said, no, that's my tree. I didn't get too many A's in school. <laughs> not doing that. Yeah, even in art class. In fact, I failed in sixth grade. That was a bad year for me, 1945. That year, my father uh, went away, you know, separated from my mother. And my sister that I really liked died in a car accident. And before she died, a few months before she died, she said to me, you know, when you go up, a lot of girls are gonna like you. How nice for a sister to tell me that, right? So now, now I make a point for girls to like me. I was influenced by Mark Toby, and then I changed to a nature motif. I changed into a magical shape because I felt that I could say more where people can relate to every day. I kind of alienated people by doing that. You know? But I felt I have to do that. You look, really? you look like a Japanese movie star. Oh, really? <laughs> when I do the work, my job is done. And the receiver takes over. It's really, uh, uh, it's their concern. It's not mine anymore. I had a psychic friend, my Yvonne Welt. She told me, one day, people are gonna appreciate your work, but you're gonna die later on after that. <laughs> he, told me that. he told me that in 1980, so I'm still okay. <laughs> so I worry when people start to react to my work. He and I go way back. You owe him. <laughs> you know, I started in 1979. Still excite me to this day, because there's something to say. <laughs> there's a lot of things to say, yeah, you know. <laughs>